Welcome to forest again, my friends. Today I want to make a little bit different video. Everybody is already tired and bored with bullets. Today I want to collect Rusula mushrooms because they grow a lot in the autumn and they look very, very attractive. They have very nice colors and I want to check how many different species with different colors I can find today. So here is the one and the tiny one there and just next to it I saw another one which might be exactly the same but it's a little bit younger so it doesn't have this dark spot on top yet. Very nice. I think I can find six, seven different colors. Let's see. And we already have another color. This one is bright red. Oh, nice. The whole basket, after I collect them today, will look like a rainbow or like a box of candies. I have a funny small basket to keep them there safe because Rusula mushrooms are very fragile. And I will collect Rusulas today. I will take two of red ones now. My friends, I literally entered the forest five minutes ago and it's already a third species of Rusula. Let's try to take it carefully on the ground. It's more yellow kind of color. Sand yellow color. Well, they will be infected, a lot of them, because now in the autumn the worms each eat every possible mushroom. Oh, it actually looks quite okay. Anyway, it's not my intention to consume these mushrooms because I, I eat only one species of Rusula, the green one, and sadly probably we will not find a green Rusula today. Uh, but I have some old footage, I will put it in the video just to show you how it looks like. So far, I can see a lot of this kind, this species of Rusula. This dark yellow color. Hey, look at this. A very big Rusula. They hardly ever stay whole until this size because snails love to eat it, worms love them. Yeah, they are eaten. It is eaten, you see. So I will not take it, but I wanted to show you. Big, big specimen. Okay. I will look for a nicer one. Another one. A little bit lighter than what I saw before. Let's check it. It looks very nice and fresh. Hey everybody, look at this Rusula and the wheat shape is growing. It started to mold. I'm not going to take it from the ground, but the hat is squished. <laughs> very interesting. Look at this. So earlier, in the very beginning, I found this one. Now I found the big brother. Whoa, big mushroom. Ooh partially eaten by the snakes already. That's how big they can grow. And here I think I have a new color. It's a little bit difficult surroundings. Oh, it broke. Take a look. It's like a pale orange. I didn't have this color before. I put it in the basket. Check it out, they are kind of 
pink color trusulas. Very, very nice. I will take two of them to the basket. Just next to them, there are the darker ones. Look at that. But I already have it. This is not Rusula. Oh yes, my friends. I have a kind of Rusula which I don't see very often. The dark one. Brown Rusula. Oh, and look at this. Kind of growing together. Very, very interesting mushrooms. These darker colored ones. Nice. Let's check this Rusula. It looks more purple than the others. Okay. Not a big one, but I will take it for now. Maybe I will find a better one. Take a look my friends, I think I finally found orange Rusula. Very nice, with orange cup. Looks very friendly, doesn't it? Another Rusula. Nice color. Well, I will take it for my basket, but I have to tell you, I'm a little bit disappointed. There are not enough nice mushrooms today. Not as many as I wanted to find. Check it out. This is how my basket looks like right now. So there are some colors inside. But not as much as I hoped for. We have this yellowish rosula. Oh, with a snails. I don't want snails. Go away. I was hoping to find a really bright yellow one. It's not my lucky day apparently. Let's put it inside the basket. What is this pinkish one? Ah, let's put it. It will add a little bit colors. One more. This dark brown. They are so massive. Ooh, so rotten. But I don't collect them for the dinner. I collect them for the aesthetic values. Here is yellow one. Shopla. Let's take the other one. Hopla. Colorful basket. Here we have some color which I don't have in my basket yet. Oh, and the huge snail eating it, of course. Hey, look at this. Very interesting, pale, but doesn't mean that not attractive. Of course, eaten by the worms, but it will be part of my composition. Hey, everybody, I found a wonderful spot for Ursula. Take a look, there is this intense purple one. There is this more pale purple one. Very, very nice. A little bit more heat, this nice color. And there is a red one, look. Incredible. Let's see if there's anything else here. There is this pale color here as well. And that completely darker. Incredible. I will add few to my basket here. Okay, my friends, this will be the end of today's walk in the forest and the end of my Rusula hunting. Overall, I am moderately satisfied. I didn't find all what I wanted, what I imagine I can, but I found a lot, a lot interesting colors. As you can see, the purple dominates with the red ones, but I have few other ones. I will actually take all of them out here on this bench and we can we can see in few moments what is the color composition of my found today. Give me a few minutes. So here there are all the colors I found starting from the yellow, yellowish green, orange, only one which 
reminds a true orange color. This one is transition between orange and red. Intense red, light purple. Here is kind of light purple. Here are purple. Here are very intense, deep purple coral. I really like them. Darker ones. And the brown, almost, almost black ones. Overall, that's my hunt today. What is missing is a green one, my favorite one, but it's almost impossible to find it now in the forest. I didn't find a white one, I didn't find a nice example of orange one, and I didn't find a very nice bright yellow one. But what can we do? So that's it. The Rusula hunting video. See you next time, people in the forest.